Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at your weather week ahead here on Arkletexhomepage.com as well as the Arkletexhomepage.com app. And looking at the weather pattern, you can see the upper level ridge we've been talking about for the past several days. Now, well to our east. Here comes the disturbance now moving through the Rockies, which will give us an increasing shot for some showers and thunderstorms, especially this weekend. We could be looking at some locally heavy rain in spots. Show you the progression of things as we move forward. You can see that as that ridge moves east, the uh, trough will take its place. We'll see an increasing chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms tomorrow, then some heavy rain possible late tomorrow night through Saturday. And then our model has uh, things shifting a bit towards the east for Sunday and Monday, but I do think we'll continue with at least a chance for some showers and thunderstorms uh, actually through pretty much all of next week minus Thursday until some a cooler area. You can see a second disturbance uh, back here across the northern Rockies uh, by Monday. That's what's going to usher in uh, some cooler air towards the end of next week. We're talking lows in the 50s and highs uh, in the 70s. Meantime, as we go through the next couple of days, looking at Robin's Toyota Futurecast, you can see that tonight. We will see the clouds increase across the region tomorrow. I expect an increasing chance for those the showers and thunderstorms as we go through uh, the afternoon. You can see those uh, showers and thunderstorms increasing. And notice the much more widespread shower and thunderstorm activity over the northwestern edge of the area. That activity will gradually spread more and more towards the southeast as we work our way through uh, Friday night into Saturday morning. And then during the day Saturday, you can see the progression of the showers and thunderstorms uh, further to the east through the area. Where the rain lasts along August across the north, we're looking at the potential for some decent rainfall. You can see a future cast indicating from now through Monday, and most of this happening from now through Saturday, uh, two to three inches of rainfall will be possible from I-30 and points northward. Further to the south, uh, most of the rest of the area can expect one to two inches of rainfall with perhaps a little bit lighter totals over the southwestern edge of the area. Uh, so with that two to three inch possibility, with much of that happening in 24 hours, uh, the Weather Prediction Center indicates that there is a uh, moderate mar Marginal to slight risk that we could see some excessive rainfall. In other words, uh, a few reports of uh, uh, flash flooding could be a concern, especially across the northern edge of the area. That would be for Saturday and Saturday night. So that's something we'll be watching very closely heading through the first half of the weekend. In the meantime, temperatures staying above normal as tonight looking at lows in the mid 70s again across the area, including 74 in Shreveport and 74 in Texarkana. Daytime highs tomorrow should rebound back up into the upper 80s to low 90s, right around 91 in Shreveport, 90 in Texarkana, 90 in Marshall, and 90 also for your high temperature in Hope. So your forecast looks like this. So moving forward tonight, we will see a mostly cloudy sky with uh, temperatures dipping into the mid-70s tomorrow. Look for an increasing chance for those scattered thunderstorms in the afternoon, becoming more widespread in the evening over the northwestern edge of the area. And then we'll see likely shower and thunderstorm activity for Saturday. That chance of rain may decrease some for Sunday and Monday and then pick up again heading into the middle of next week. We'll likely see the worst of the rain out of here by Thursday. And notice the trend in temperatures. We'll see daytime highs mid to upper 80s through Tuesday. And then as the winds shift to the north, we could begin to see some cooler air sneak its way into the region with highs in Shreveport, low 80s by the end of the work week and nighttime lows by Thursday morning, upper 60s. Could see some 50s in Shreveport by next weekend. And Texarkana, you can see your numbers look like this as we're looking at the moderate impact for the next several days with good rainfall chances. It'll be most widespread tomorrow night through Saturday. We'll notice uh, with the rain around Sunday, upper 70s for a high and you'll settle into the upper 70s for highs by the middle of next week with nighttime lows eventually in the middle 60s by next Thursday. So all in all, get the umbrellas and dig them out and keep them handy because the rainfall chances begin to increase tomorrow. will be most widespread as far as the rain Saturday and we'll continue with a decent shot for some rain for much of next week.